Hi, I'm Matt Thompson, Hefty Naturals brand manager. And I'm Rob Fritz, lead agronomist, Hefty Seed Company. And today we're talking about the next steps of Hefty Naturals. We've talked quite a bit in the past and you've probably heard about NutriCycle and Heat Shield, the foundational products to Hefty Naturals. Now we're gonna talk about the things that we've built that add to those that are the next step. The whole focus was what can we do to make things happen in these higher pH areas and to look at a product that uh, some products that people have never even thought about before, you know, silica, phosphorus, the products that are out there, sulfur, you know, these are things that aren't in the normal conversation. So we know based on a lot of operations that we've set foot on that higher pH soils are a detriment to a lot of farming operations. Yes, and pH, as we've talked time and time again, is a symptom. When you have really high pHs, you probably have high calcium, high magnesium, something like that, driving that pH up, which usually leads to nutrient tie-up. So the number one issues that we have identified in a higher pH environment is we might have great phosphorus levels in the soil or good potassium levels in the soil, but we can never see it in a tissue analysis. No. And what's happening is, is the, the clays in the soil are tying up all the nutrients. So we went at that with some very specific microbes. We have enhanced phosphorus solubilization, we have enhanced potassium solubilization, and we have enhanced sulfur ability in microcycle. Those are things that are super key to higher yields in those environments. We took multiple strains out of microcycle, sent them off to a lab to identify where they would rank amongst activity at higher levels of pH. And those are the microbes or the strains of microbes that we've put in microcycle to work on a better farming operation with higher pHs. Right, and we've been super pleased with the way that it, the product came forward. Obviously it's an in furrow application or what we've been experimenting with lately with excellent success is actually a foliar application. So the product is very flexible. So talk to your local agronomist when it comes to foliar applications. We're working on collecting that data now in 2020 and should be able to have it throughout the fall campaign. Yep. But it looks good so far. That's right. The next product that we're probably even more excited about if we could be uh, is a combination product of Anhydro and Boost 10. Yeah, and when we're looking at that is, this is the first Hefty Naturals product, Boost 10, that doesn't involve any microbes. That's right. So it's our first non-microbial product that we've emphasized. And the whole idea is it makes the nitrogen much more efficient and it makes photosynthesis much more efficient. And what is it that all our crops do to make crop? It's Sunlight. photosynthesis. Sunlight. So we're focusing on that and then we're adding a microbe that helps assist that process. So we have identified two things that a plant really, really needs during its reproductive timing. We gotta be more efficient with photosynthesis number one, Absolutely. and we gotta have late season nitrogen. So we've got a product with anhydro that has four strains of nitrogen fixing bacteria that we're taking nitrogen from the air and fixing it to the plant. Right, and when you add that to the Boost 10, which we believe these two must go together in the tank, we can actually, in both corn and soybean crops, actually promote that late season end use and the photosynthetic cycle that it supports. So to Rob's point earlier, you've got a biological product with anhydro, comparing it and combining it with Boost 10, an amino acid package. These two absolutely go hand in hand together and they help with nitrogen efficiency late in the season. And that's microcycle and hydro and Boost 10.